So today, I didn't have much time with you guys before we had to plan this, because usually what I like to do is get all your ideas together, and you guys come up with amazing ideas, and then Tuan and I think about it, we work together, we make sketches, and we try and use your ideas to make a plan for your school. But we didn't have much time, unfortunately, because we have to get this into the council to say, so they can say, yes, you can build your playground. So we've designed something that we thought you guys would like. We had a few, a few little bits and pieces, some people drew some things, and we had a bit of a list there, but we want you guys to have a think about it today. So today is about you guys looking at this and saying, I really like that, but I would also like to do this, or I would like to do this or this, and I like to think about what you guys want to do in your playground. Yes, young man, waiting very patiently with his hand up. Thank you very um, much. We can't make it too high, otherwise the preschoolers won't be able to play. Well, I think a little bit differently about that. I think that if you guys, see I watch, I've got three children and I see them, we go to the playground, oh, what's it called, down the end here near the duck park down here, there's a plastic playground there. And when my son was four years old, he could do it all. He could climb to the top and he'd go down the slide. So once you've done it, what do you do next? I think it's good to have something that you guys can't do, because then, over the years, you'll try and try and try and try. And if you try from when you're reception right to year five and in year six you finally get it, how do you reckon that'll feel? Happy. Awesome. Yeah. yeah. Do you know, can I just, Taylor, did you ask that question because your little sister's starting preschool? Mm -hmm. Isn't that divine? And that's lovely to think about. Yes. Um, I don't think you're allowed to do role play in that So maybe some, that is a very good idea. We usually put that sort of thing in. I like to be cubby building where you have village play like that and do role play. But we could potentially put some little play um, elements like some serveries and stuff underneath those platforms there. So we could do that. Great idea. We do have a couple of little nooks over here because I like these learning spaces too where cause when I was a teacher I liked to do all my work outside. So I used to do my reading and my writing and my maths all outside. So having little places where you guys can spill out and work is what that area there is about. So, so if that swing was here, that means the rope would be over here and then where the house was, so the house would be here and that big mound. That was the house. The house would be about here where that mound is over there. So I turn my plan around like that. Here's the road, like that. And then right over there, see that big gum tree? Yeah. See the big gum tree? Yeah. yeah. Can you see the big gum tree on the plan? It's an yeah. orange dot with a tree around, with the, with the, with the greenery. Do you see it? Yeah. yeah. So that other swing would be on the other side of that big tree over there. Right now, I'll leave yeah. leave you some designs too. If you want to go back to your class, and show them and they can write some things on the plan and give some feedback back to us and we'll make some changes okay so you guys can explain that to your classes and anything you guys can draw pictures or do anything like that and get it back to us to make some changes all right nice to meet you guys have a lovely day and we'll see you next time see you later you guys want to say thank you to Tuan? thank you